sound. I cannot hear that in sound. is above all gods. How many are with me on this scripture? You must praise the Lord. For the Lord is good. You must sing praise unto the Lord. For it is pleasant unto the Lord. For the Lord hath chosen Jacob unto himself. And Israel for his peculiar treasure. For I know that the Lord is great. And that our Lord is above all gods. When was the last time? When was the last time you took time to praise the Lord? To thank God for what you are going through. To thank God for whatever good or bad. God wants to be worshipped. When we come to the house of the Lord. God wants us to raise our hands. In worship and in thanksgiving. God is not happy. When we are so starchy. God created us for a purpose. And that purpose is to worship the Lord. And we must worship the Lord. The Bible says, For the Lord had chosen Jacob unto himself. And the Lord chose you for a purpose. Hallelujah. Amen. It's not an ordinary thing for you to be sitting there. God chose Israel unconditionally. And God chose you unconditionally. So you have every reason to thank the Lord tonight for what God has done for you. And Branham tells us that the the Holy Ghost has been sent unconditionally to the people of God. Amen. Amen. He says, God has made an unconditional covenant. He swore by the death of Jesus Christ. He sent the Holy Ghost back upon you to be a confirmation that the covenant is made with you. So it's unconditional but you must receive the Holy Spirit to show that you were there before the foundation of the world. Blessed be the name of the Lord. And God has loved us regardless of what, who we were. And he has made Away for us to receive the Holy Spirit. Now, Pastor Kominja was preaching the new birth. Up there in water. It was so solid. I said, Lord, help me to measure up to this message. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Now, the prophet says, All right. We find then taking the church just back for a, for a little preview 
found out that God promised Abraham that he would save him give him an unconditional promise unconditional covenant he would save him and his seed not all his seed but his promised seed Isaac blessed be the name of the Lord so we ought to praise the Lord with all that is within us hallelujah amen now many times we are full of memories. We are full of complainings. And we miss a lot of blessings from the Lord. At times God does things to us. Things that are good for us. But because we are using a kind of eye. We don't see the good in that. That's why those that are not saved. As the pastor was saying the other time. Even at funerals. See people grumbling. They say ways that are not right. Instead of thanking the Lord. You must learn to thank the Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. Now, in Psalms 134, verse 1, the Bible says, Bible notes, Behold, bless ye the Lord. He servants of the Lord Which by night stand in the house of the Lord Lift up your hands in the sanctuary And bless the Lord The Lord that made heaven and earth bless thee out of Zion there are some people even tonight that has never found the courage to raise their, their hands and praise the Lord hallelujah Amen. can someone raise hands with me tonight and say blessed be the name of the Lord God, God loves that God is happy about that and it shakes away demons Hallelujah. Amen. It makes you receive your promises. Hallelujah. Amen. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Abraham so, says this message. In the crossover message in the contest. He says, make us fit servants. Forgive our past. Bless our future. Guide us. Oh Lord God. Because you need a guide in your life. You cannot lead yourself. We said many times you lead yourself, you are always blundering and failing. And you are full of regrets in your life. But if you allow God to guide you, something good will happen. He says, Guide us, Lord, with thy mighty hand, Jehovah. Bless these ministers here. Bless all the laity. All the visitors. If they are visitors, God bless you. Be thou with us, Lord. We are your servants. We give ourselves wholly to you. For 2024. Ah, tichitra gorera 2024. That the power of your spirit might have more preeminences in our life and in our being. Help us, God. Forgive us. And help us, we pray. Raise up mighty men. Raise up mighty warriors of faith. 
Open this year, Lord. Vurai gorerino ishe. That hidden manna. Ah, iyo manna iya irimucha mwakavansika. That rock beneath the rock. Iroro dombo no one kwa musasimiri me dombo. That we might see the program of God. Kutis chuko kwansa kuna urongo wa mari. A cap off the pyramids of our life. Zino ka. You know that right? Amen. Amen. It's God that puts a crown upon you. of God. And if we miss by an inch, after 10 years, we'll be 100 miles off the top. We need to stay in the program of God. So that we don't miss the written part. So he says, May his great magnificent holy blessings be upon us all. May the fire of the Holy Ghost come upon us. May the power of the resurrection be manifested. God, how we thank you tonight. We give ourselves for you to you, Lord. Brothers and sisters, we need to see the program of God. We need to see the program of God unveiling before our eyes. And if we see it unveiling before us, we can start to praise the Lord. But when you're walking in inundation, when you don't know what you're doing, you've not been lost to life. You have nothing to thank the Lord. You have nothing to hold you accountable to the things that you must be doing. Because your eyes have been blinded to the cause of this message. May God open our eyes tonight to see and to realize what God has done in this generation. What God has opened our eyes to in this hour. This is a great message. This is a great awakening. Hallelujah. Amen. The Bible tells us that a seed must rot. Hallelujah. If the seed does not rot, if it does not die to itself totally, it cannot reproduce. Hallelujah. Amen. So if we have to die, and reproduce the fruit we have to be grateful unto the Lord that God has given us a message that can really separate us totally from the world so that we can produce the life of the message God is looking for people that will go back to full obedience of the word of God as was Adam in the Garden of Eden. 
God wants to change our hearts to that spirit of full obedience. Where when God says something, you have no question about it. You just want to express what God is saying. You just want to be a co-worker with God. You are now seeing the program of God. Because it's not your program. It's the program of God. Hallelujah. Amen. Blessed be the name of the Lord. So we need to climb the ladder to the top of the pyramid where there is that full anointing where there are no dark shadows. Are we together? Amen. Amen. You know, uh, I was uh, seeing you in quietness and I thought I was alone. So I'm seeing it's now pulling me. But today I don't care. I will just do uh, what exactly the Spirit is asking me to do that. Praise the Lord. Amen. Amen. So we have to climb the ladder. But to climb this ladder, it's a real battle. But we will make it by the grace of God. Because it's God who did the choosing. Abraham says, when God calls a man, he equips him for the journey. God has equipped you for this journey. God has given you ammunition for what you are going through. Just be grateful and thank the Lord. And let God give you a realization of how to come out of what you are going through. So that you don't apply the flesh in what you are meeting right now. But alas, my brother, my sister, we apply the flesh too many times and we distort the program of God. We end up being natural people instead of being spiritual people. Hallelujah. So we must profess positively. We must speak right things that give the right anointing. <clears throat> Amen. Amen. So I was saying there are no, let me read this one. As we go up, there are no dark shadows. I once read this quotation before. Abraham says, and remember, there is not a remedy in a doctor's book for it. Why? Say, it's oppression. Demon oppression. Like a dark shadow hangs. It's always causing you to be that way. But he will heal you if you can believe. If you believe. God will help you. And you take away that dark shadow. God knows what to do. Are we together? There are so many dark shadows. If you read the spoken word, the prophet speaks of them. These shadows of cancer. Another sister came and says, that shadow is very dark. It's, it's death following you. And some of it is temper. Adultery, many other things. But as, we, as we're trying to go up the ladder, we are getting closer to the light. And as we are going up the ladder, you come to that full pyramid where there is neither shadow at any given time. Because you are holy in the light. So the scripture says walk in the light and you become the light and you become a light to the world. You become a light to your family. You become a light to your environment. But I want you to praise God as you go up that ladder. God has equipped you to go through that ladder. Hallelujah. Amen. God knows your past. God knows your today. And God knows your tomorrow. 
Thank God for what you have not arrived yet. Speak the right things. Be grateful. Hallelujah. Amen. It's very important. Because I know some people are not grateful tonight. But God is trying to remind you be thankful for your pastor for your husband for your wife for your children for your job for what you have right now God knows what you are going through God is not a fool He wants you to go through what you are going Hallelujah when that church broke down when I was passing by with the car and I saw it I said blessed be the name of the Lord God's ways are past finding out God knows how to put us in a better place God knows what to do When he wants you to fast When he wants you to pray God knows what to do And God is doing it right now To put you in the fold To put you in the direction That you can be a better person than who you are Hallelujah Amen. Don't despise today What in Asaka shut up and say, ah, today is so mm -hmm. bad uh, even uh, more than yesterday. Mm -hmm. Ah, that's the spirit of the devil. Because, uh, you know, you must be content of what you have today. Hallelujah. Amen. Blessed be the name of the Lord. The Lord says, God knows your future. I don't but you are suffering with a nervous condition that is right just about the time of your life if you have to have that for you to face that uh, situation that you are facing it's God who is allowing it to happen Amen. that's right you've got a dark shadow it may not live overnight. I might not leave you today. But have faith. Then you got trouble in your back too, haven't you? Amen. So healing is a process. Hallelujah. Amen. When Brother Branham came, there was a time he started to pray for people. And he was enjoying miracles. Hallelujah. Amen. And people were coming to him. And they were pressing him. Come and see a great miracle. Come and see this happening. Hallelujah. Amen. Praise the Lord. And then the angel of the Lord came to him. Because he would spend hours praying for someone. For that thing to happen. Eventually the person would get healed. But God was not happy. He said you were sent with the gift of divine healing. And healing is a process. You must have faith. And keep that faith. For you to remain healed. Hallelujah. Amen. Healing who last as long as they're faith. Salvation who last as long as they're faith. Rather, when you lose your faith, you lose certain things. So always be thanking God. I want to thank you, Father. That I am your child. That you chose me before the foundation of the world. And one day when you're walking to the shop, when you're talking to your children, you can start saying, if we look upon a banister, I was there. When God was creating this world, I was there. When God was creating the world, speak about yourself. Hallelujah, speak about yourself. It gives you a realization. And many times, when you speak about those things, there is a strange anointing that comes. That like wants to lift you up. Because the deep call a to the deep. But when you hear the message of the hour, there is something in your heart. That just wants to say, Hallelujah. Let us be the name of the Lord. Because you came from above. And you are going back to that place. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. 
So you mustn't lose heart in this world. When things are difficult, there is that power. There is that strength. There is something somewhere, somehow, that keeps holding you. And the thing I had to sing, something keeps holding me. Something keeps holding me. There is a special tag. There is a special move that keeps holding me to the word of God. So we must be grateful. Even in time when we want to quit. Because the times the going gets so hard. Do you want to say, should I remain in the message? Should I remain a believer? Should I remain a minister? Should I remain a deacon? Brother, don't quit. Hold on to the word of God. Thank God for what you're going through. Because the times really get hard. And you go on your knees and you ask the Lord, did I marry the right wife? Did I marry the right husband? Am I at the right workplace? Did I make a mistake? Hallelujah. Amen. Those are the times to go on your knees or to stand up and to to raise your hands. Say, God, I want to thank you for this condition because you knew my future. You knew I was coming to this. And I know that, Father, what you've begun in my life, you are going to finish. You are not going to leave me alone. But even if I go through the water, I go through the fire. One thing is certain. I am not alone. I am not alone. You are not alone. You are not alone. I know. Sometimes you ponder hard. And you can't sleep. You can wake up four times a day. When situations come. But brother, what has helped me in my life? I start to thank the Lord. I don't care how bad it is. I start to thank the Lord. Even it's making me cry. Even if I'm so much ashamed of what I've done. But I say I thank you God. Even for giving me the realization. That I have done wrong. But some people have not that conscience. They don't like dumb to They have no remorse. But, but when you do the Lord, the Lord something wrong. You shudder into shamefacedness. Even when you want to pray, you feel like you want to look so dumb. Because you know you have a maker. Brother, that's grace. That is grace. To know that you have a maker. When men have forsaken you. When life is gloomy. And there's darkness. Something keeps holding you. Something keeps bringing you back. Brother, God will hold you. You have a fear tomorrow. Rest, my brother. Be at peace. You know some brothers are saying, now we know. When the children are going to go to school, you are going to suffer. Brother, it's God who is holding your life. It's not men. Men will always be men. People will speak what they say. But God remains God. Hallelujah. Amen. And many times, men, all the times, men has never, ever been a good person to detect his future. Brother, I know one day you are going to sing a brand new song. When God has done a great thing for you. Brother, you are going through hard times. You know, Miriam, when they crossed the Red Sea, nobody told them. But inspiration. To hold the tambourine. 
And they sing a brand new song. You are going to sing a brand new song. When you come out of that dilemma. Hallelujah. Amen. Start now. Sing a brand new song. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Because change is definitely coming. Thank God for the future. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Thank God for the mountains. Thank God for the valleys. Amen. Amen. Oh my. Oh, in Blessed be the name of the Lord. Are you crying tonight? I want to remind you. Psalms 35 says. For his anger endureth but a moment. In his favor is life. Weeping may endure for a night. Weeping may endure for a night. But joy cometh in the morning. There is a joy that comes in the morning. If we keep uh, this word, there is a joy that comes in the morning. There is joy unspeakable in this word. If you are not happy in this word, there is something wrong somewhere, somewhere. Because joy comes from the word. You cannot compare it with the joy that you are given by this world. Because you have got something that came from God. And that thing can only be given joy by the Lord. And it can also be given peace and rest by the Lord. Amen. Amen. We thank God. That is made us priests and kings. Revelation chapter 1 verse 5. And from Jesus Christ. Who is the faithful witness. And the first begotten of the dead. And the prince of the kings of the earth. And to him that loved us. And washed us from our sins in his own blood. And hath made us kings and priests. Unto God and his father. To him be glory and dominion forever and ever. You must have this tendency of just thank, being thankful unto the Lord. Learn to be happy. Learn to rejoice. Now when we come to church, when Brother Victor is singing, you can see the brother is in the spirit. But these dark shadows that follow people, they make them shy. They can't even dance in the spirit. If we sing, have a grand round and have gone round and round. You know, you see uh, the other one just. Uh, you, are not, you, are not, you are not different. You have a dark shadow upon you. Hallelujah. Amen. When we are supposed to go round, we must all go round. Because we have a director here. Brother Branham speaks of the symphony of music. You know, when they are singing in the orchestra, they will be looking at a director. They don't care about your reaction. They are looking to their director. We are not looking to the song leader. We are looking unto Jesus. The author and finish of our faith. Don't you have anything that the Lord is doing for you? You must claim, you know, when you are in the house of the Lord. But you are just, you know, uh, numb. You know, you be clapping like a daisy girl. There is a dark shadow that's hovering and following you. Let me tell you this night, there is a dark shadow hovering and following you up. You know, my brother's wife died. When they came from South Africa. And we went into the church. But this one is bigger, but maybe three quarters or half, I don't know. 
three quarters of halfway the size of that church. And those uh, in a year got Kure. No, but just five or seven of them. Ah, mango bana man seven. Who came from South Africa? Waka from South Africa. And they came to the podium with their Waka pastor. Waka bawa wia podium nemfu ni swao. When the pastor said, Lion of Judah. Waka ngon nemfu ni swao. Shumba erudi wa Judah. The way these people responded, they filled the whole church. Madaviri waka ngon ita vano. Iwa wa shoma nini iwa wa waka bawa zaza kichichios. But if we are uh, speaker, you know, as deacons out there, we can hear one another in our conversation. While least in church, they are singing. There's someone who will be not singing. It's a spirit of heaviness. Hallelujah. You know, I'll ask, you know, after this service, that people should sing. Uh, as I'm and preaching, I want uh, Moses to be on the keyboard because if the spirit of God is upon me, you know, I can sing. Sister, if you have not uh, sang before, you must sing. So that you are not created that way. 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 Prophet said, uh, you know where the spirit of God is, there is life. Why is, uh, is there no life in you? Uh, the reason why you know you're moody, you are moody is because you know you've got a heavy dark spirit hovering upon you. And in that spirit of heaviness, if you want, if you put on the garment of praise, hallelujah. I was trying to read something in the in the afternoon. When I just get a hold of it. When I was in town waiting for something. You know, I, I, I found myself, you know, dozing. See, I'm reading the word and now I'm sleeping. I said, ah, that's not, uh, you know, uh, the, the heat the of the wind heat wave. Ah. Then I said, I need to fight. I took my earphones. <laughs> I took them in my ears. Then I said, ah. Uh, uh, brethren, there are certain spirits that are there in this world. Following you up in the church. You know the preacher, you know, will be trying, you know, uh, trying to bring out his message. While these people are just numb and there's a, a dark shadow following people which doesn't want people to be free in the house. You must say hallelujah. You know, people will be shocked when somebody says hallelujah. Why are you shocked? Why are you here? Why did you come? We came to worship the Lord. We came to see the Lord. We have got our challenges and our problems. You must not bring a, you know, a, a, a tiresome spirit upon us. Hallelujah. Amen. If a person does with, well, pastor, there are people with the demons. Ah, uh, I'm May the Lord help me. Because I'm also crying, weeping with my problems. If a person does something good, you you <laughs> see people <laughs> saying, <laughs> uh, Amen. 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 You have got a dark shadow hovering upon you, sister. You know, when, when a visitor you know, has come, you will say, ah, brother, can you give me ten so that I can take you know, the visitor you know, for Nando's? I was so happy when Brother Zaba preached. You know, there's a certain sister who came and said, Are you not going to prepare you know, luncheon for the, for the minister? I said, uh, You know, you know, uh, you know you've uh, uh, changed my ways. You know, let us go and prepare. Because you'll be, you know, believe me, Brother Zaba. But, but, should learn to respect the vessel. Hallelujah. Now I went to another funeral. When brother brother Nathan Masuka. when the father of brother Nathan Masuka passed on. 
The way they would respect the ministers, I said, no, 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 don't, don't, do, don't do it that way. Maybe it's the teaching uh, of their churches, but they are not far away from the truth. Ah, but you find people, they don't have any revelation. Uh, and they'll be losing blessings out of them. And they want, you know, to bring, to lower down the bars of that one who is doing good. You must not be caught up with such a spirit. You must say, Lord, you have expressed Explained uh, such a wonderful thing that makes me to become a good brother and a good sister. And you know, I want this good spirit so that uh, you know the uh, work of the Lord progresses. You know, a person might not have uh, the money, but uh, you know uh, that person might come and you know clean up the chairs. You know, it's something that you know uh, we were running short of. You find people who come and clean up the chairs. You don't have money to give for cement. Uh, you can't even thank God by saying I'm now carrying the chairs for you, Lord. Uh, you know, I, I, I feel ashamed, you know. When this brother, this other brother went, it went to, to Highfields. Uh, so went in the evening and there was this lady who came in. You know, she was uh, 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 making sure, you know, she uh, <laughs> kept all the chairs, you know, uh, for the wedding, for the venue, uh, and cleans them, and she started sweeping, and she started, she started to tie it up. I don't know whether she had a car or not. You know, after she uh, completed all, uh, you know, uh, what she was doing, she said, I'm doing this because we don't want to be late for service tomorrow. Revelation is so good. If someone has got the revelation, please don't pull down, you know, the faith of that person. May the Lord help us. Amen. Amen. If you, if you give uh, you know your car to go for <laughs> out of, for, for you hear a sister coming and say ah, ah, your, 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 your husband is so good. you know i found out that this this spirit is a spirit of uh, pulling down the things of god you know the works of god we must do exactly like uh, wow, wow, the likes of Nehemiah and uh, those uh, with him, how they were doing it when they were building the walls of Jerusalem. They were, they were building the walls while they had, uh, they had uh, you know, spears you know, and, uh, and, and arrows in their hands. We must not uh, uh, try you know, to find people who can come here and prepare you know, for the builders while they are building the church. Because this church is so big. Just preparing sadza for the builders. You know, my message is now, you know, going somewhere else. You know, I wanted to say good things. Amen. I But it's the Lord. Uh, because the brother is also seeing it's not on my notes. So it times certain victories. Ah, but it's when we kunda it comes by just doing those little and small things. You know, you would want to say, you know, if the Lord has done something good for then you, then you start worshiping and saying, Lord, you are so faithful. That that God 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 the God who entered into the spirit of praise. who opened the Red Sea. Not to always enter into the spirit of uh, scolding and being rough. Uh, just say amen to this. Amen. You must say amen. You don't say amen. amen. I want an amen from you. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 We went to Kuruma with our wives. Uh, you know, uh, they are not used to dance. Uh, you know, we would see people you know, dancing around, you know, shoes being thrown while they are praising the Lord. We found ourselves in the ring. Uh, you know, we came here and we wanted to <laughs> But you hear a certain anointing, you know, a dark shadow hovering. 
Say, ah, it's, it's, uh, it's, it's getting a hold of me. These men are strong. These song leaders are very strong. You know, where there's life, you know, you must showcase that there's life. Ah, this other year when we were in Shuota, uh, with sisters, uh, we said, ah, they are, you know, spiritual sisters. You know, they would say, hallelujah, bless you. But when the spirit of the Lord uh, came brother, upon I'm sorry, we failed to fight them up. They were shouting hallelujah in the spirit. There will be something that would have happened. You cannot do such a thing uh, when uh, you know there's nothing that has happened. You can only do that if there's something that has happened. I'm not saying you must do this, you know, uh, you know, by your, your carnal mind. But you cannot complete five whole years without even uh, being, you know, emotional to things of God. Sister, every good hallelujah. You know, this corner you'll be you'll be ah, having sisters, you know, who'll be looking, you know, at each other, you know. Be grateful, like man. enemies. Here some were given gifts. Some they live, uh, you know, higher than others. You know, you get into the rapture, you know, under such a similar situation. Because that's what the word says. But a person with the spirit of the Lord can talk to anyone. You know, you, you can't see me, you know, with PPT each and every time we are just the two of us. The church is growing up. You must talk to other believers. Uh, because when you, uh, you know, if your, your relative or someone dies, you know, from your family, you say, ah, those people, they don't even care for me. Uh, but you were just, uh, uh, the three of you, you know, uh, fellowshipping, you know, because until people, yes. believers will be fearing, you know, to come closer, to saying, this group, this group, they are way. And you know, the ones I'm talking about, because they are looking at me right now. You must, you know, a cohabit. You must dwell together, together with others. Say. Because in heaven, you will be together with every brother. Uh, you don't, don't bring, you know, uh, your clans and, and, and groups, you know, at church. <laughs> ah, Thanksgiving, Yaramba. <laughs> oh, but I thank the Lord. Yeah, uh, you know, I've walked in a long way. I'll be seeing this thing. You know, I'm allowed, you know, I'm given permission. Denial allowed you to. You know, if, if I miss, you know, a certain point or something, just, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm given the, the freedom of the city to say out these things. Those things are bad. Those things are so bad. They are so bad. You know, after the church, you find someone, you know, uh, you know, in the car, on, 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 on his own. When they are too busy. Uh, when there's a funeral, you know, <coughs> from this other corner, you don't go there. Uh, at your, 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 your family, you know, if, if there's death there, where you ever told, you know, through the phone that there's death. Were you told, you know, from your family uh, members that you should bring me? Uh, when my uh, <laughs> granny uh, passed on, you know, <laughs> I had to, uh, my uncle, you know, I had to go during the night. <laughs> and uh, when I arrived, I asked him, how, how is it? Do you have... You cannot ask me when I'm with my relative. You know, when we are uh, grown up like this, you know, we must not be, we must not be drove, uh, you know, for us to go and console our own, you know, this is not uh, a colored way of doing this. That's unmessageical. It's also as if I'm running a message, that you there's nothing like that. Who knows who's the greatest? Aunyare. Aus kusoda. Aishimbo soda wa shamara. Ah, pa shimbo nyara wa. Even in this one yard, 
Ah, uh, you together with me, you know. Huh? We must be blushing you. No, zaka na usora ngofiro. Awo zeyo kuchema kutu mwuzo zino wada zeyo. You know, if you have not... Asi, nganyazo kuza, nika kwa yungu chafiro. If you have not, you know, uh, seen, uh, you know, a death in your life, you know, you will never feel the same way. But let me tell you, one day you are going to experience this thing in your family. You will learn to console others. Also, sister, kana urawara wago na ubika. Unofano to skombo wa kini na mba. Uda kuzwa na ane kutu. So you don't know if the sister falls sick. Wako sister, kana urawara wago na ubika. Uh, get there and help you in, 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 in a cause, you know. Uh, so, uh, when are we going to grow up? I uh, you know I just love things that uh, uh, continuously improve. Uh, there are times that you find uh, that this person is failing to grow up. You are just denying, you know, to, to, to grow up. There's a certain, you know, uh, age when there's uh, a problem in your family, you know. They say, go and see these, uh, uh, these boys are here, you know, they will solve this problem up. If there is any situation or a problem, you know, the pastor must find us busy, you know. You must say no. Pastor, and I am going to run you. Things are moving on well here. I'm going to go to I'm going to go to there are times, uh, you know, uh, when you feel, uh, I was talking to this other brother, you know, so, I was saying someone. So I wanted to go there. And the car that I wanted to use. Then uh, they, they just uh, developed a, a problem. Tire punch. Then I had to change the car. After changing the car, then I got into a congestion. So I, I almost got out of the spirit by just uh, you know, warning you know, to other cars. Uh, then I was told, telling this other brother, said, this is the worst, you know, late every time. It's just a demon. The guy said, this was right you know to cut off the head there are times you just feel I must, I must just grow up hallelujah ah. may the Lord help us even your own husband even your own wife there's a certain time when you just make a U-turn I want to grow I want to come out of this. So you must not continue to hit uh, you know, uh, that person down. You must help and encourage. Uh, so you must, be, you must be motherly. Because the person that has decided that he wants to come out of the problem. Encourage in the hope that person to come out of that problem. Encourage in the hope that person to come out of that problem. I'm not saying, you know, uh, in trying to come out of that situation. A person a person might not make a out. mistake. Be grateful. You must thank the Lord. Uh, you know, when you see your De? child, uh, you are eh? starting to take uh, some, some steps. steps. Uh, you know, uh, Amen. 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 Uh, you have got a child who was, uh, you know, uh, a problem. Uh, always rough and promiscuous. Uh, but you see, uh, she, he or she is taking the right steps. That's the time for you to thank the Lord. That these things were not there on my child. These things were not there. Hallelujah. Amen. Uh, when someone was hosted by this other brother, he said, no, Musabati kana ama, marinde yangu. Then I say, the guy don't worry, brother. As I am saying, this guy, Mary, go put down my mom. I got a mind. I will use it uh, when I get to Vero. The guy, my mom. I prayed for that young man when I went home. The guy, Mary, is saying, "Maru pa vazo bamba." Because I'm seeing, you know, uh, footsteps, you know, in the right direction. You must thank God in those little and small things. Hallelujah. Amen. Because. Elijah said, I can see the abundance of rain coming. But there was just, you know, a cloud which was uh, the size of his uh, power. So if you see, uh, you know, uh, the whole field, if there is uh, a corner that's ripening, you'll see, that, you'll know that the whole field is going to ripen.
Christianity has got, has got stages. As you climb up the ladder up to, the, to, the, to the capstone, there are wars that you'll be fighting. You know. But in all those wars, you are climbing up now. Encourage what is good. Hallelujah. Amen. May the Lord uh, bless you. Amen. Amen. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Uh, we want to thank the Lord that God sent us a message. When this message came, uh, the prophet got a hold of it. When he got a hold of it, uh, there was a revelation. When he got the revelation, uh, you know, it was too much upon his heart. And he had to bring down the revelation. Uh, and it came, it uh, cascaded into the sight of Moses. Like what happened in the days of Moses. After God had uh, Moses to give an anointing to Hallelujah. Joshua. Amen. Amen. You know they crossed the Red Sea. But uh, that river Jordan. Ah, but Jordan. When the priests were holding the ark of the Lord, as they stepped in the water, the waters had to part ways. And the ministry must progress. Hallelujah. Amen. They were given, you know, a commandment. Jericho. That you must go around Jericho. Hallelujah. Amen. Shouting. Ah, uh, the last day. They were supposed to uh, go around times, uh, you know, shouting and praising the Lord. Hey. I believe in that church. They were sisters. We were going hallelujah. Hallelujah. But he must see what is actually shout that day. Why for how could I shout for the victory? Shout for the victory. Hallelujah. I want you where you're sitting right now. Shout unto the Lord. I say thank you, Jesus. What is she going around your situation? Shout, blessed be the name of the Lord. And the walls of Jericho went down. They didn't do anything, brother. But God thundered the Upon the walls. And the walls crumbled. Some of the problems that you have. When you come to church, sing with all your heart. Rejoice with all your heart. Say hallelujah. hallelujah. Say blessed be the name of the Lord. Say amen. Say I thank you, Jesus. You must shout. You must shout. And say hallelujah. My situation is over. Hallelujah. My child is going to prosper. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I'm not going to be a sinner anymore. Hallelujah. I'm no longer an adulterer. Hallelujah. I'm no longer a liar. I'm no longer a liar. Amen. Hallelujah. And this city in your opinion. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Shout hallelujah. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Thank the Lord. Worship the Lord. Get in the spirit of worship. It's not on as much demands of oh, these things will man. just go. That's the genealogical spirit. That's the genealogical spirit. That's the genealogical spirit. There's nothing that is too hard Shout to the Lord. Shout unto the Lord. Shout unto the Lord. God to make a way for you. These spirits are just nothing. They are bluff. Hallelujah. Amen. This other brother told me this other year. He said you must go to Harare. Uh, you must be uh, yeah, chased away from work. And you must become just uh, a, 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 a pauper. Hallelujah. Amen. And I said, oh. I said, it's you saying that. God never said that. Hallelujah. Amen. Uh, you must thank the Lord for people who just uh, uh, speak words. I mean, uh, because they are not God, they were not there. Uh, when they are uh, the foundation of the world. In, 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 I was there when this was And uh, we we see see the sun, you know, can't you know, And I saw the water I was in the Lord Jesus Christ. When he went on the cross. When he was alive, I was identified with him. Hallelujah. Amen. So who is this uncircumcised first time? I can come to die and, and say unto me, I am cursed. That's a lie of the devil. There's nothing of that sort. That's the lie of demons. It's you who is cursed. 
There is no one who can fight against a Jew and win that battle. You are a Jew. You are a son of God. You are a Jew. You are a Jew. There is a host of angels around about you all the time. You have an association with angelic beings. You don't walk alone. There is the pillar of fire leading you all the way. Let me tell you. 1951. When they despised this message, the prophets stood. He said, May the Lord God of heaven and he said the pillar of fire had to come through the people saw the pillar of fire when they when they came into the house it rested upon the men of God it silenced all the critics until today we have the only religion that has been scientifically recognized the heavens Testify. And the signs testified. And we testified before the foundation of the world that this gospel is the truth. These are not fables oh, that we believe. No, say. Whosoever gets you, I am returning back and those who gave to go back to them. In the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. of God. Let me declare tonight. Whatever they have done, I want Satan. to praise the Lord tonight. That it has been reversed by the blood. The blood that fell on Calvary. The blood of Jesus. The blood has power over everything. You can stand before the blood of Jesus. You know, just deny and uh, they can't do anything. You are a child of the king. Don't be despised. Even if they say you are going to die tomorrow. You tell them, tomorrow I'll be the one burying you. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. I went back to that place. I, I, I had no money. Then I said to uh, my wife, I, I've got this other car at work that saves fuel. That's the one that I'm going to use because we don't have But God had to move elements so that I would go with a very big car. Uh, when I got there, they said, It's you. I said, Yes, it's me. I said, It's me. God knows how to deal with fools. Because you are not just sheep people. Uh, if the Lord will just open your eyes and see the grace of the Lord upon you, you would not fail to sing in church you like you do. You know, I, I've got this, uh, you know, pride with those people who doesn't want to sing in church. There's a darkness hovering upon you. You must deny that spirit. You must, you must refuse that spirit. Hallelujah. Amen. May the Lord help us. I remember this other story. Uh, which I was told by Dr. Stoll. I like Stoll. that story. You know, when he went to his uh, rurals, when he was testifying, then a certain uh, person said, Enoch, you want to be troublesome in this, uh, this area. That was a witch doctor. Because that witch doctor was a problem in Chipinge. You know, I saw when I was You know, he was called by this And he had to put that uh, little thing on, uh, on, on a hard rock. 
Then he had to. You know, uh, you know, worship, you know those charms, <laughs> and he had to pray. He was cut off to become chaff. Don't play with uh, Wasu. But I know But you know Wasu behaving, you know, torn up shoes. You know the devil is <laughs> not merciful. Amen. Amen. So when uh, <coughs> brother Stole met up with that <coughs> uh, You are going to die Then uh, <coughs> mother to brother Stole You know I uh, started to You know to have fear for, 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 for your son Until doctor Stole <coughs> said uh, He's the one who is going to come <coughs> Then, uh, then uh, brother Stolle said, my mother came around 9 p.m. She came to check, Enoch, are you still alive? <laughs> then she went to sleep. <laughs> 12 for midnight. Said, because uh, the mother knew that this one was uh, uh, a problem in the area. Uh, one o'clock, the uh, mother was there. Uh, as the mother, you know, came uh, up and, hour, and uh, she ended up just sit, sitting on the door, thinking of this, uh, around three, four. Uh, there were certain men who came. Said we want to see uh, a witch doctor by the name Enoch here. Say, the mother responded and said, I don't have a witch doctor here. I've got my son here. And they said, Our granny, you know, is almost dying at home. You know, brother Enoch had to go and pray for that wish doctor. From that day, he was honored in his own area. That's exactly how you are. Uh, if you only you knew. Uh, the reason why they failed to, you know, get a hold of Bruai. Uh, you think God uh, will be happy for those people to trouble you? Can God smile while they are troubling you? Ah, uh, you know, you don't know how, how this God is. Uh, you know, we also uh, uh, played with people who thought they were great men. Uh, I saw him coming and said, uh, of a truth, you are, you are uh, an apostle. He said, but why do you uh, worship this God using names? I said, you were troubling me. It's the reason why I went to tell my God. I said, this man, I'm failing to find uh, you know freedom because of this man help me out no you let us just uh, silly things trouble you uh, this other sister would uh, uh, do this when her children would fail to get their monies from those who are in europe and they would, you should say give me the names of the people whom you lend it money to then you tie up you know the names on that pillar of fire Every choose the right side. Ah, she pity check a check a shoot fast. What did you offer? Yes. When I am going to talk about the money, we can my children be troubled by this man? He is not paying back the monies of my children. Hands why is what? Now one o'clock, one o'clock, one o'clock. You would hear a person knocking on the door. Now I have brought your man. Please forgive me. I was told that testimony when I was with the pastor when we attended the same funeral. He said, oh, had no uh, challenge, you know, when it comes to our money. No. But now we are, we are mourning our mother because, you know, in her presence there was nothing that would happen. Uh, you need, uh, uh, you know, my bounds are A when you are a believer. Uh, you must place the pillar of fire there. You know those things will fight in the spirit. Yes. Amen. Amen. Uh, there is a why when the prophet would uh, move around the world, you know, they would say, You are really a man of God. How do they see that? Because the uh, spirit around the believer is always, always sweet. Uh, the spirit of uh, someone uh, who uh, doesn't hear uh, the spirit of the Lord is always heavy. How can you, uh, you, be, uh, you know, have a free spirit when you are full of loaded with all these spirits? But you don't know it. Uh, you know, you'll be uh, modeling like that. 
if you push that person in the, in the corner, then you discover the things that in this woman, you know, are so big and great. These are uh, uh, the ancestors. No, my mom was telling me another story. My mom went to the Kenya. Uh, when she got was married, in the you know, to, 70s. to, to, to our As rose. Uh, there was a certain witch doctor who came and she wish. wanted to cleanse up the world. Uh, because, you know, uh, the <laughs> uh, in laws, you know, <laughs> you know, he was an old man with one eye. Uh, when uh, this man got to uh, one of the the, 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 the wife. <laughs> He stood, you know, while he was holding his mouth. Then he had to uh, take off his head. Then he gave to his assistant. Then he knelt down. And he started to, 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 to claim. He said, uh, this one is greater than me. Then uh, he approached the next woman. Don't play. When you see these people walking down the roads, they are full, they are loaded. I went to buy, uh, you know, beans with brother Alec and okay. When we were uh, helping uh, a small farm, beans, there was a certain, uh, woman, the light in complexion. I said, uh, can, I, can you give me snuff? I want snuff. Then uh, she was given snuff. I said, this one is a very Then the sister, uh, the small girl who was selling snuff was buying He said, you are buying your, 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 your sugar beans. Just uh, uh, stay there and see the ladies who are going to buy snuff in here. Those little girls who are, you know, finishing off our young men. <laughs> uh, brethren, <laughs> I've got a certain, uh, you know, brother of mine. <laughs> you know, I escorted that. Guy. Uh, when he fell sick, he, he said, said he escort me with the car. Car. And we went, you know, to uh, their rouse. He was, he was uh, like he was almost I'm dying, you know. I'm and I'm I said, I'm, I'm just yes. escorting so that he goes there and die. <coughs> when we go to the rules, uh, then I uh, said, I had to give them a seat. <laughs> then the, the grain, you know, had to uh, bring <laughs> out uh, snuff. <laughs> And he had to put snuff, you know, on the head. He gave him. The, gave him. <laughs> and he started to <laughs> take the snuff. <laughs> then the <laughs> grain had to, uh, you know, <laughs> he started to cough. <laughs> When he uh, did uh, the same thing six times, <laughs> then, <laughs> then he came to life. <laughs> then he was <laughs> now back to normal. He was healed completely <laughs> in my eyes. You know, there is gross darkness in this world. And the reason why I said I want to thank the Lord for this message. I want to thank the Lord for this message. The reason why the prophet said if you say you are a minister or uh, a preacher, go to Africa. Because Africa is loaded. Africa is full of injustice. Africa is Zara Mitombo. Yeah, Mataura Shachero. Mitombo. 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 People are loaded. We once uh, prayed for this other no I'm going, I'm going. And and she she jumped. Jumped. I get Africa. Africa. You must thank the Lord for this message. Oh, we're praying for that sister and a brother Manari and China brother Trinos. That's you and a brother Manari and brother Trinos. Not there. We could you know, you chain the eight tons from Kang. Yeah, I would Okay. Yeah, we are in Africa. We're in Africa. We're in Africa. We're in Africa. We're in Africa. But you'll be saying, I've got my damn self. You know, if, uh, if a woman, you know, mm, is pretty mm, in your eyes, you know, by the face, you know, you must not. Uh, but if she's just clean from the heart, you know, she'll be clean, holy. 
person without character is uh, difficult to stay with. Some are crying, weeping as well. I mean the truth. There are men who are crying and weeping in this message. I don't know in this, in this church, but they are there. I, let me say out this I thing. I once preached in South Africa. My brother came to me. Said, brother, the message that you were preaching, you know, you were sent by God. The wife that I have, she's so stubborn. Uh, if you don't pray for me, brother, I'm going. I'm going to just forsake that woman. You know, there are people in problems. Hallelujah. You need God. Uh, if you are like that sister, don't be, don't, don't be like that. Uh, you'll be thinking that the brother will not forsake you and run away from you. You find him, uh, you know, not there at home. You know, I, I, I saw God in that After praying for that brother, I didn't know the wife. When I prayed for the uh, brother, you know, the wife came. I think and she came and she started to testify and said, I know my husband doesn't love me and I know it. Amen. You know, I was listening to this message while his brother Branham was saying. But it now I was preaching. You are saying that I But an anointing has just come down. An anointing has just come down. And it's for healing. And it's for healing. It's now a different anointing. <laughs> That's what he says. He says it's a different anointing from the Christian man. My sister. Sisters. You must come, you know, uh, to church under ex great expectation. My brother. Brothers. You must come to church under great expectation. You know you know Sunday, Sunday, after the preacher, uh, you know, finished preaching. When they, you know, people want to, to start singing, you know, you, st you see people walking out. Uh, the prophet said, you know, the anointing changed, you know, uh, that anointing would uh, address your issues. That holy song, uh, when uh, a holy song, uh, you know, is uh, about to be sung, <laughs> so that tomorrow you become a good sister, <laughs> then that's time uh, for you to run <laughs> to the toilet. Then you start, uh, you go out and you start talking to the other no, sister. That's being foolish. That's being foolish. Are <laughs> uh, you bathed, you know, from home? Uh, you know you are not at peace at home but, with your husband. but now when the anointing of the Lord wants to come and get a hold of your soul that dark shadow that we are talking about comes hovering on you being played when the service you know is about to come to an end they must not walk out they must grow up as musicians right now, right now, you must go back to your positions. An anointing for it to come. And you know, you must grow up in the message. People who are looking at me right now, some of them have got a lot of baggage. I've preached for a few years. But in my heart, when I preach, God has cut me in a way. When something presses upon me, I know. Do you know I know if it was, uh, you know, along a back but there, I would see. But you know, uh, yesterday cannot be a better off than today. Because today is better off. You see, these this darknesses of unforgiveness is so strong. You only see it when you manifest. When you are now speaking and your action, it shows that you have got bitterness. But you, you, you yourself, you don't know it. Because you are wrapped up in that bitterness. You don't know. We need the grace of God to come upon us. 
so that uh, you know the grace of the Lord can help us so that uh, someone can come out of his or her problem I believe in a God who forgives you know in the rurals where we come from they are full of evil spirits because there are certain people you know our relatives no one has to prosper uh, you know just uh, very soon not long back there was someone who told me that there is nothing you are not going to amass anything in your life then I laughed back. <laughs> I said, don't you see what the Lord is doing? <laughs> no, gradually, slowly, things are moving on. The cogs of life are moving. <laughs> no, they are living now. The devil can try this and try that until the devil will say, this one is under my feet. He knows he's not going to rise. Devil, you are not God. The devil is not God. God has not finished with you, brothers. I can't finish what I have. You know, I did something, and I waited two pages, but I was diverted. But I believe the Lord had a purpose. Hallelujah. Amen. You know, people, I'm glad people shouted. Uh, I'm, I'm glad that people shouted at Jericho. You know, the Lord must also pull down, you know, the, the walls of your life. Because, you know, you have been uh, a pauper for quite a long time. Uh, how can you uh, continuously uh, go on without money in your pockets? May the Lord help you. <laughs> Uh, things uh, you know are so hard you know you don't have rentals you don't have grocery. may the Lord remember you tonight Lord if I have paid the truth remember your children so that something can happen so that uh, you are free at liberty without stress hallelujah amen and when Christ went on the cross he hung between earth amen and his blood went down it, it cleansed us and the veil of the temple rent into twain and it gave us you know uh, the freedom and liberty hmm? to enter into the holy of holies you know, a place which was uh, you know taboo for people to enter in it became our home then this man from Kentucky came and he began to unravel and reveal things that were said to be hidden and mysterious and that thing which was mysterious is now resident in our hearts uh, some will be saying uh, what will be saying uh, this one is just uh, uh, and I'm we know where it's going to Even happen. Even when all events happen, so. We are going to see the same thing. 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 We are was tough, tough to thank the Lord for. You know, if you remain, you know, you can tell people that uh, uh, these things that's uh, happening now. Uh, you know, if it's gambling, you can pay and say, "In this chapter, but bomba richa knowing fully well that you are going to pay with your blood but you can even because we have been given all that we need 
You see? Yeah, no, you will not be knowing the date, yeah, but you will be very sure. It's now 33 years. And in a vision, there is no vision that I you know, missed. There is no prophet that missed in Iota. He's the only man who had to say such statements. And he told us. He said, you with gifts. If you see it missing the word, you must be, a hands must be laid up upon you because that's demons. You know, the problem with those with gifts, you know, if, they, if you tell them that they are, uh, you know, prophesying or doing it amiss, you know, they don't want to accept it. And they don't want to repent and say, ah, wope zia kwae waku, kwae wa anyanisi, so that's why you must incline yourself to the word of God. You must always incline yourself to the word of God. And you fail. You will not fail when you have got the word. But gifts, you know, they are needed in the church to cleanse up the church. Hallelujah. Amen. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Amen. Blessed Tino Muru Visa Shewe Ma Zishe Ama Tino Muru Visa Isu Tino Muru Visa Tese Tino Muru Visa Oi Shewe Ma Akuna umwe wakafana na na Akuna umwe wakafana na na Akuna umwe wakafana na na Shewe mazishe Na shaya umwe wakafana na 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 shaya umwe That story I love about Mizpe. Uh, you know, when the Lord thundered upon the Philistines. The Bible says. Bible not. So the Philistines were subdued. And they came no more into the coast of Israel. And the hand of the Lord was against the Philistines all the days of Samuel. God can bring down his mercy until the hand of the Lord will be always upon you in all the days of your life. Solomon uh, when Solomon was building the temple of the Lord, the Bible says Solomon was given peace right out of bounding. Uh, when he needed firewood, when he needed bricks, he when he needed uh, the sida to build, praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. God can open avenues and move elements until your business will prosper, giving you peace and favor. These are not fables. I'm not the one who wrote the book. The hand of the Lord was against the Philistines all the days of Samuel. I want to read it this evening. The hand of the Lord was against the Philistines all the days of Albert Mandivay. 
During a pub, you must read your name in this scripture. We have something to thank the Lord for. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. This can just come. Slavery in opera. Uranda. Unapka ope. Uranda waka pera kwa America. Slavery, you know, it ended in America. Abana yu watam church msiwoyo. You know, nobody would sleep in church. Wana waka nila uzwari budo. In the days of emancipation, people were waiting anxiously. Ana great expectation. Some had to climb mountains. Waiting for that great day. Waka wama nae jube. For that jubilee trumpet to be sound. Kuma baka tanga kurita. When they started to sound the trumpet, they shouted and said, The sun has risen. And those who were in the middle of the mountain, they say the sun is risen. Those who are down say the sun is risen. Let me shout and say the sun is risen tonight. The sun of the pillar of fire is risen. Entering into the hearts of the children of God. You know, removing all darkness. Praise the Lord. The sun is risen. Sing for us, brother. Praise the Lord. You know the sun has risen. You must shout victory. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Dino sha miswa kwa zo haiwa na maba samakuru iyo. May the Lord help you as well to forgive those uh, who you have trespassed against. So that uh, you know you don't trust trespass against others to become a Christian. I want to pray for you. But I want you to thank the Lord tonight. Some fell sick. They were supposed to die. But you are here uh, this evening. Some were involved in accidents. I was involved in an accident. And I, 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 I accepted. I said, I'm dying now. I see the Lord kept me alive. Some, they went through hard times. There are certain places and certain uh, places that you entered into. And, uh, you are even shocked how you came out of the situation. You can start even weeping, you know, crying if you think and ponder uh, what the Lord has done for you. You must thank the Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. I am the Lord and he led me. I am the Lord your he 
I said my word and I healed your disease. I am the Lord, your healer. You are the Lord. You are the Lord. How we gave you something. How we gave you a job. How we gave you a car. How we gave you a pastor. How we gave you friends. Brother, some of us lost good friends. We lost mothers. But Jesus said, I will give you mothers. I will give you fathers. Oh, hallelujah. Blessed be the name of the Lord. God has given you the message. When you're so much unworthy, you are standing there as a paradox. You are standing there as a phoenix because of what God has done. God is good, brethren. May God do something new for you tonight. Do something new tonight. Yes, be there. I'll call the pastor to lead us in closing. Hallelujah. Amen. But let us be grateful tonight. Thank God for your wife. Maybe you were screaming at one another. Maybe you wronged you, but thank God. Yeah. If you are grateful, it casts away evil spirits. Hallelujah. Amen. The Bible says Bible note. when the two of you are gathered <inaudible> and you agree. <inaudible> so if your husband and your wife agree, <inaudible> whatever they desire to do, <inaudible> it will prosper. <inaudible> because it's thus says the Lord. <inaudible> Hallelujah. Amen. Brother, we want you need. Unity begins at home. Then it comes to church. As office bearers. And together with the pastor. And then we become one big ball of fire. There is no enemy that's going to stand before us. And the devil is when we join hands together to pray for our brother you won't go anywhere God will bring him back because we are one thing so we want to be united in the name of the Lord Jesus Pastor Commission Amen. Amen there is a precious hiding place Hallelujah thank you Lord The precious hiding place in Jesus, in Jesus I oh this a place of heavenly grace in Jesus. The side in Jesus' side. There's a precious one more time. Oh, there's a precious hiding place in Jesus' side. Oh, in Jesus' side. Oh.
Brother Zababa, they say to worship is to honor and to show reverence to a supernatural power. Praise the Lord. Is to regard with great respect. Is to honor. Is to show devotion. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. Overcome your victory. Kunda. Bye. Kuburikids. Worshipping the Lord. Neku shumira neku rumbiza man. Praise the Lord. Amen. Praise the Lord. Praise Amen. the Lord. What a great message. I can see the devil has crumbled tonight. I can see his back has been broken tonight. Hallelujah. Amen. You will never be the same. Just believe it and move forward. Praise the Lord. Oh my brother. Yeah, you can, you can start it for us. Yeah? yeah. You know what you do when you want to be victorious in a message that has been praised? Just dive into the anointing. What it is doing. Don't try to make yourself do what the message is saying. If you try to go elsewhere, you are wrong. So, Amen. just do it. Put it on, put on the garment of praise. Put it on, put on the garment of praise. Let's put our arms together. Then the spirit of heaviness shall flee away if you put on the garment of praise put it on put on the garment of praise put it on put on the garment of praise oh and the spirit of heaviness shall flee away if you put on the garment somebody raise your voice tonight Oh, yeah. 
Our brother is going to pray for us. But there is nothing that forbids you to also pray. Because it's a victorious day for Israel. These Philistines, they will remain subdued forever. In all the days of your life. Amen. They've tried it on Hamas. Where are they today? The likes of Hamas tried it. Tried it. Very penis. They get saved by a court. When they started the fight, we thought they were men to stand the heat of Israel. These demons, they will not stand your heat as well. Praise the Lord. Just believe it, my brother. My sister, just believe it. That's the end of that demon. That worries you every day. Today it has met its own match. What an anointing. Praise the Lord. Yes. Glory. Tukutenda imponesi mabojesu manirano Maita enyi mtwene Nekutini rapakari pedu Mwari mtwene Shendi manga mjipari kwa pano Timi mwari mwari Ziva zina anu zato pina na nazo Maita enyi mwari Nekuburu za mwari za kafani ya pangu Waka waka kozera Jehova mwari Timi kuta la rutiziro Timi mwari mtwene Mwari mtwene Hana zewa na venyu Mai wana msere kule mero Mwaka kakaita wana venyu Mwari msene mwaka feme Na msene mfundi smari Kutiva unza mpati Mwari naka fana na wea pano mwari Kona ukutenda Mwari wangu na mambu wangu Nesa tosa pati tuwa pano Tino zitenda mwari Ukukujika kwedu mwari Manerano Tini kutora maswe muengi Satani mwari Shanga di komba kwa kareba Satana angatiru isamu zainano Asima nerano mwari masumu za chiero Mwari musene wa frisia Vauya mchale pa upenyu wedu Mwari zinano zose Chai uya pa wana venyu Manerano mwari masu atresa Dimi Jehova mwari Waka mboru wira tefti pane menguma Haka ni mapuri e pasani Andi kompa Asima ni kunyake mapuri e pasani Aga komba David Mari, Mari maga murwira zaga daro, mana venyu Mari, aga kom kade zinano, mana venyu manerano Mari, Mari masuchwa yezaga seda siana, asu Mari madipa the way outi, maita venyu Mari, ne udi pam chen ziram, ne kubuda na yo Mari, pa ne possibility Mari, there is a possibility oh God for us to come out of those situations. Pane mukana manerano mari Wekuziki ni uwa mari Zuari ya pala panamu Mari mufise ni iya Nakadani zira Mari pala pota soni Where are you? Oh manerano mari Muri kuziki ni uwa mari Manerano mari Muri kusurungura Manerano mari Muri kuisanzira Mataura maru wangu na mambu wangu Munga ni mune isanzira Kunyange mugumba Mune isanzira Munyange musene Munziru zakaoma Mune isanzira Munyange muurwere Mune isanzira Munyange ise munyika Ya wira pasi mari Oh ise wangu na mambu wangu Mupono vita kati uza Kuli menga katenda sinu isi Haja kara mune menyika Haja taura ise Mwari zizi itika Dilo soko mari Raka ni mpono fita Asika kuchelimani Varoi mari vanesa Nganga zaita za sakaita Haka taura kati kore hiri Harina simba Pamsopo wana wa mari Uwele Hauna simba Pawana wa mari Mari zose Zahiri wisa wana venyu Hazina simba We have the power of God To change the situation Tine kutaura mari Mwenyange kuchikinu wa kuwana venyu Tine kutaura mari Ukamti wa mewe mchene Kuwana venyu Maita venyu mari Ropa fazai mani mufuni zimani vei Mani ne mari zweri mwaka Tine kutu wa mchene Sini na mulo pare nu mari Tine kutu wa mani manerano Tine kutu wa mani manerano Tine kutu wa mani manerano 
Oh, eternal Jehovah, we shout for victory. We shout for, for the baptism of the Holy Ghost. Oh, thank you, Lord Jesus. Makanaka manelanu. Tiro dadi zira kukunda mari. Tiro dadi zira kukunda sivi. Tiro dadi zira kukunda maboto ose mari. Oh, thank you, Lord Jesus. We are shaking the devil. Satan, we are defeated. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Oh, thank you, Master. Talk with ten day, Mary. Timmy, Mary, Mucene. Makaisan Zira, Mungu Mungua, David. Mary, Akom, Ganima, Pure, Pasan. Asimari, Pagatana, Pamuri. Makaisan Zira. Tino, Zamarima, Mukundi, Zama, Pure, Pasan. Hagiri, Jehovah, and the Mufuswagu. Apana, Chaniga, Sahiwa. Tino, Tuka, Mapure, Pasan, Mary. As you pray, my poor passion, the Gushema Scoofies, my poor passion, a Kenza, my poor passion. Maria, my projects are doing a passy. Does it too come on in a hano? No Musita and Muloprajes, Isain Sina Mari, Matois and Sina Mari, Macadimunes and Sina Imi Mari, Unyagamu Benga, Posta Pana Joseph Mari. Pada kubukira kwa makwenga Ma business ya wana venyu Haka kuwira pasi mari Gasi muke Nekuni Joseph wa parizwa Mari mutsene Oh me you help us Lord Jesus Tiri kushika mchina Tiri kushitenda mari Shoko hiri mari raka sika Unyange tindi Shoko hiri mari raka sika Wanga wana mazi wasina mazisi waka piwa Shoko hiri mari raka mucha Wana wanga wafa Mari mananga tsipa netrak. Mari hadi zimu situation yaka fana ne mana ya mutseli. Anga tsipa netrak tapa ponda atemu kamari. Oh eternal Jehovah, may you help us Lord to come to ourselves to realize that oh God we are eager heavenly Father. Oh Mari ma ita heni. No papa zayi mfuli skomi chumari. Mari mwa ita shaka naka unyange mutseli zima sima ne ma projects. Oh sari kito palu mari. Gabu di kire mari. Maita heni mwane kutira ngarira Maita heni mwane kutira ni hana zedu mwari Hati zo viva ni wame chete Musure me mariza ya kadai Hati zo rambita kadalo mwari Taku ya namperi We are possessing Lord Oh thank you Lord Jesus Mati musene ishe kupozwa Kuno kara kana mwati jikutende kushika ipapu mwari Tipe mwari Tisa turu wano wakaipa Mwari chingwa zata katishika mwari Toko pae mbili mato pae remekezo Lopafa sayi kereke henu Lopafa sayi tosi ngari Muzita ni muro prajesta na mani kutenda Amen, amen Glory Hallelujah, praise God. Ropa ra Jesus, ropa ra Jesus, ra kaere ra hari so perisi. Ropa ra Jesus, ropa.
receive now we know if you don't see we know that is that dark shadow that has come back praise the lord mm -hmm. we let the church we know that is that dark cloud that has come back again Friday, I would like to believe that one. Friday things will be better because the evil spirits have been resented tonight. Friday, I think Friday there's going to be very good singing because we are now new creatures. I've yet to preach, but tonight there was some preaching. Man. Praise the Lord. Shall we take our seats? I become a proud father. To bring up a boy. And he can preach a message where I can write notes as well. And become so encouraged in the Lord. Ah, this is wonderful. Amen. Amen. Glorious. Wonderful. I really appreciate that anointing. Praise the Lord. I'm not going to go through what he has said. But I want to tell you I believe what he has said 100%. Most of the times I've been fighting against these spirits. But I'm glad in a different way. God has spoken it again tonight. Praise the Lord. God is so wonderful. God, Enjoy with me also. My wife turned 49 years on Sunday. Amen. Amen. She has been a very good missus. Praise the Lord. So as she's going into 50, I really want to be close to her and see how she gets into 50. The mind has matured very well. Old things are gone. She is very focused now. When the brother was reading here, make us fit servants. Bless our future. Guide us. Raise up mighty men. And the warriors of faith. That we might see the program of God. I really triggered something. If you walk without knowing the program of God, then you are going nowhere. Praise the Lord. Vero, I hope you also recognize what God is raising in your home. Vero. Pray for this husband. If God wants to unleash anything, let us see more. Praise the Lord. God is so good. You know what, what I thought when my wife turned 49? Now I want to be with her very close. And, and teach her more the message. So when I'm going anyway, I go with her in my car. Talk with her the whole day. It's time to be very close to my wife. Praise the Lord. Amen. Amen. Yes. Thank you, Saints. Look at where, where we are now. Through your efforts. Oh, that is your effort. You have been paying the money. And the trustees have been able to perform. But they are just nearly finishing it. 
Today we are more than 300. So if you put a dollar each, we'll have more than 25 bags to do the, 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 the other portion again. So we just want 50 bags. I'm persuading you to just pay $2 each. As you go out. Praise the Lord. Do you think we can do this? And tomorrow they can come and just finish up to here. Are we together? I really believe it. And I've got a lot of trust in you. Look at what we have done together. Praise the Lord. When I look at you, I see God's people. Co-workers together with me. Praise the Lord. God bless you. Can the deacons just stand on the doors, that door and that door? We don't go out through this one. Yes. Let's just put in two dollars, even five dollars. Can I say ten dollars? I soon give you ten dollars. You won't be arrested. You know, by uh, it will make us uh, able when we to come finish back off with this Friday, tomorrow. But don't so come say we we'll have a different fest together. We get that too. We need to make sure Praise the Lord. Ishe varubizwe. Vero, Vero. Usamba ma pizza kafana ni a James. Don't uh, give him the same uh, portions of meat with James. You need to really treat him like the father that he is. Yeah, he preached to my soul. He traced those evil spirits. Ah, he he Without the word, it was going to be very difficult. Praise the Lord. Amen. God bless you, saints. Let's come early again on Friday and just do what we are supposed to do. Praise the Lord. May God bless you. Amen. Amen. You know, he was talking about just entertaining visitors. Here, do you know we can do it? I used to have visitors come from South Africa. Kudzi and Victor would always follow. Kudzi na Victor vai tira nyesho. And take the visitor. Oto ora mienzi. Go with them to a hotel. Wenda na wako hotel. And just lighten the burden. Ongo re ruto mtoro. Before they got married. Was that wrong? But I don't know if uh, marrying really downgrade the effort. No go gas viringi zanyesho. We are just praying that the Kudzi and the Victor we know may do it again on this visitor. Amen. Amen. <laughs> Let them do it together with their wives. Praise the Lord. Yes. yes. I also see sisters come for prayer meeting after after work. Yesterday, yesterday I passed here. Bambo was here. Brother eh, Bambo Brother Onias. Brother Onias was here. And some few brothers and some few sisters. It really put me in the spirit. Come here. Pray for your home. Pray for your children. Pray for your soul. It's only for an hour or two. The brothers drive off. So sister, I go to Don't rot with things there in the home. Bring them to the altar. And we see that there are other brethren. Brethren, before we pray, I've got a situation that I have that's pressing. While you are praying, assist me with this as well. Praise the Lord. Brother Joshua is always here. Brother Joshua, 
Brother Diva is always here. Brother Diva, I know Brother Simon is always Brother here. Simon, I know Many other brothers. They will always pray together with you. I want to say God bless you. May the Lord be with you. Amen. 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 As you sing. Washi Duda Kura Hirwa Nemi Kuchengeta Shoko Re Hey.